Bella Swan may have been unconditionally and irrevocably in love with Edward Cullen, but Kristen Stewart would have kicked him to the curb. On Tuesday, The Love Lies Bleeding Star, who portrayed Bella in the Twilight franchise alongside Robert Pattinson's Edward, got real about the on-screen couple's intense relationship on Amanda Hirsch's Not Skinny But Not Fat. When Hirsch asked Stewart, 33, if she finds Bella likable looking back at the franchise, which ended in 2012, today, the actress replied, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, you better be careful, she joked. I don't know if you can tell who you're talking to right now. But the host pressed on, explaining that she found Bella a little desperate for the brooding vampire and was far too willing to change her life to be with him. Stewart quickly jumped to Bella's defense again, telling the host, well yeah, but he was trying to sort of control whether or not she made choices for herself. I would have broken up with him immediately, she said matter-of-factly. I mean if I was like, hey, I want to try that, and he was like, no, this is just for me, I would be like, well, this is also just for me. My whole life. Without you. When it comes to Bella and Edward's romance, Stewart said she does understand the protection thing, but at the end of the day, you gotta let a girl make her own choices. Still reflecting on the hit fantasy franchise, Stewart also reacted to the viral moment from Twilight's sequel, New Moon, in which Bella's other love interest, Jacob Black, Taylor Lautner, says, Bella, where the hell have you been, loca? Her reaction? Yeah, what in the world? I wonder if that was in the script. What is that? Is that in the book? Maybe it's in the book, she theorized, pointing out that there are idiosyncratic, weird little lines, like Edward's iconic hold on tight, spider monkey, that were pulled directly from Twilight author Stephanie Meyer's pen. Stewart also recalled another line in which she had to point out Jacob's muscular build, New Moon's hello biceps that she just couldn't get right. There was this one that I couldn't deliver at all, which was so embarrassing, she remembered. But there are still parts of Twilight that Stuart remembers fondly. Earlier this month, she reacted to the wedding scene in Breaking Dawn, Part 1, telling Who What Where that she still loves the gown, so much. Yeah, I think if I were to ever do like a classic wedding dress, this is kind of the one, she told the outlet. I'm not going to do it, but I got to do it, she said, adding, I appreciate that.